It's taken decades and spanned almost half the country, but Ronald Burr is finally being held accountable for what he did to a little girl in Concord so many years ago. Burr pleaded guilty to four counts of aggravated felonious sexual assault from the early 90s when his victim was younger than nine years old. I'd like to apologize, sir. I was wrong. I pray every day that he could get the closure and do better. I'm so sorry. Authorities say Burr and the victim were known to each other and that the abuse lasted from 1990 to 93. The victim, now a woman in her 30s, was living in Tennessee when she disclosed to authorities what happened to her in New Hampshire. They directed her to Concord Police, who launched an investigation which led to criminal charges against Burr last spring. An advocate read the victim's statement to the court this morning. When I heard he was pleading guilty for the first time, I felt relief. It's been a lifetime of being caught in limbo. I wanted closure. I wanted to stop being silenced. I had lost myself for so long, I finally am feeling whole. Burr, who is 55, was sentenced to 13 years in prison. Judge John Kissinger said his apology fell far short compared to the damage he had caused to the victim. Well, one thing is certain, a very bad man is going to prison for a long time and children in Tennessee, New Hampshire will be safer as a result of that. Prosecutors say they agreed to the plea bargain in part to save the victim the pain of going through a trial. Reporting live, I'm Andy Hirschberger, WMUR News 9.